Okay, I'm going to show you how to tune your Windows Vista for audio. Uh, information on this can be found in the Optimizing Your PC for Audio on Windows Vista. Um, this will help your FireWire interface run better and may help it connect if you're having problems. So the first step is to change processor scheduling. To do this, open up the Start menu, go to Computer, right-click and go to Properties. This will open up the uh, system information. On the left, uh, select ad um, Advanced System Settings, which opens up your system properties. Go to the Advanced tab on this window, and under Performance, select Settings. This will bring up a new window. In Performance Options, again, go to the Advanced tab, here you can see processor scheduling. Uh, you've got a choice of either programs or background services. Select background services and click apply. This will give more processing power to the drivers that run your FireWire interface. Okay, so you click OK to close that. The next step is to configure power management um, to make sure that you've got enough power to run your CPU smoothly and that your computer is not going to go to sleep. So go to the control panel, which can be done by clicking on the control panel on, on the address bar. Uh, you need to select classic view so that you've got all the options. And go to power, or power options it's called. Okay, so once you've opened that you can see the power plans. Uh, make sure it's on high performance so that power is not limited to the CPU. I'm just going to the options for that and check that put to, uh, the put the computer to sleep is selected as never so that it doesn't go to sleep while you're recording or playing audio. Okay, click and then click save these changes to make sure that stores. Right. The next step is back into the control panel um, to disable the system sounds. So click on the control panel in the address bar again. Uh, scroll down to find sounds. Okay, open that up and go to the tab that says sounds. You'll then see sound scheme. Select no sounds as this will stop any sorts of beeps or sounds that could appear while you're recording and spoil your rep recording. Click apply and click OK to save that setting. Um, the next step is to enable DMA. Um, so, from the control panel, go to System. This brings up your system information again, and go back to the advanced, uh, not uh, advanced system settings, device manager this time. Okay, so when that opens up, you should be able to see all your devices. All right, you need to find all the IDE channels. So this has two. If you go to the properties of those, you can select the advanced settings and make sure that enable DMA is ticked. This basically uh, makes sure makes uh, data from hardware go straight to memory rather than having to go through the processor. So it speeds things up a little. Uh, make sure you do it for all the ones that say IDE channel. So I've got two, so I've done it for both of those. Okay, now close that window, that one's the steps done. Uh, final step is just to disable Windows Firewall. So in the control panel, go to Windows Firewall and make sure that it's off. If it's not off, just click on the Change Settings uh, option and then you can click Off. This will help free up some resources and stop any conflicts with programs that you might have. So there you have it. Your PC is now tuned for audio in Windows Vista.